Hi, awesome people. Welcome to our Pets Academic channel. Today, I'm talking about the topic, Can Hermit Crabs Eat Turtle Food? If you are new to our Pets Academic channel, please subscribe. You can also like and comment on our videos so that we can get to know you better. Consider reading the full in-depth blog post I have written on this topic. You can find it by going to the link in the description. So, let's dive in. Some people wonder whether hermit crabs can eat turtle food. The good news is that hermit crabs can eat turtle food if it does not contain any harmful ingredients. As part of a balanced diet, you could give your hermes some turtle food sometimes. Make sure to check for any potential toxins or allergens before feeding them this type of food. What is a hermit crab? Hermit crabs are small crustaceans found in a variety of habitats around the world. They range in size from one quarter to four inches long, depending on the species. Hermit crabs have soft, oval bodies and a hard outer shell that they use for protection. What do hermit crabs eat? Hermit crabs are omnivorous scavengers, meaning they will happily eat both meat and plant-based food. In the wild, hermit crabs enjoy munching on small fish, invertebrates such as worms, plankton, and any food particles that happen to be floating by. They also like to snack on seaweed, fruits, and vegetables, including bananas, oranges, berries, lettuce, kale, and spinach. Commercially prepared hermit crab diets are also available and should be complemented with fresh fruits and veg for a balanced meal. Hermit crabs have high metabolisms, which means they need to eat often, so it's important that you provide them with a variety of nutritious foods. If you're looking to give your hermit crab the best diet possible, make sure to feed them several times a day and always give them fresh. In the full blog post I have written on my website, I have done hours of research and I have written much more details about the above topic and subtopics. The blog article is more than a thousand words, and I dive into each of the above topics, covering many more questions around them. Just click the link below, and you can read all about my research on this topic. See you inside the blog post, and let me know if you have any more questions in the comments below. Have a great day, and thank you for checking out PetsAcademic.com.